I'd like to tell you a story about bullying, harassment in a Pennsylvania school district. My client is a teenage boy who was changing for gym class at the Boyertown Area School District. While he was partially undressed, he looked behind him and noticed a girl standing there wearing nothing above her waist other than a bra. He was naturally upset, so he went after class with a group of friends to go see the principal to find out what was going on. And the principal told him, hey, I've got no other options for you. I'm going to ask you to tolerate this and make it as natural as you possibly can. He wasn't told beforehand. His parents weren't told beforehand. No parent was told beforehand that the school was going to be making a change to their locker room policy. Instead, they put all of these students in a position of sexual harassment and bullying on top of it because to raise your hand and to stand up and to say there's something wrong with this, they're going to be made out by the school to be the wrongdoer. But every student deserves to be free from sexual harassment. Every student should be free to not lose their personal privacy, their bodily privacy, while they're changing. Here in Pennsylvania, we have laws that state there's supposed to be separate facilities for boys and for girls. And this school was violating that law. The school was violating his constitutional right to personal privacy. And the school was, was violating Title IX and the requirements there to, to prevent sexual harassment at our school districts. That's why we're bringing suit. We're bringing suit to remedy this situation at the Boyertown Area School District and to help other school districts throughout the state of Pennsylvania understand that there's a better way to treat our kids, a way that doesn't bully them into giving up their rights to personal privacy.